Well, it started, I, I followed Jim at USD, and right when I got the job, I called him to, uh, first of all, commend him on what a great job he did at USD, and thanks for leaving me the big shoes to fill down there, but uh, he's always been helpful, whether I come up here recruiting in the Bay Area or, or just talking to him. I know Jim was fond of, of San Diego, having lived down there, so he had an open invitation to come by the coaches' offices, and he'd come in and visit, so uh, always uh, really respect him, great uh, respect for him as a coach and as a person. Yeah, and just same, same for me, uh, um, two former quarterbacks uh, and, uh, and our, our relationship uh, and our ties from, from USD. Uh, I coached down there and, and Ron uh, came in after and uh, just did a fantastic job. I was so excited when he got the job here and, and uh, some of his assistants uh, were guys that either coached at USD or played there, Jimmy Doherty and Joe Staub, and, and then to fit, fill in the staff with the, uh, uh, some really fine assistants. Uh, tremendous coaching, and uh, and we guys are out here practicing. I think it's uh, I'm jealous of that because I wish we were out here practicing right now. <laughs> Coach Harbaugh, what was your impression of the practice? It was good, good. I liked the way they scrimmaged. Yeah, I like that. I like uh, building of a callus. You can do that in, in spring ball. Uh, guys flying around, a hundred guys out here uh, practicing, practicing football. It doesn't get any better now. They get after it. They play in a physical style. It's a reflection of their coach. Let's hear from Coach Jim Harbaugh. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, but uh, just what he's done thus far for a coach like that to come talk to us. I mean, argumentably, you know, top five uh, coach in the NFL for him to come talk to us here at San Jose State is big for us, big for our program, uh, big for our motivation. Uh, just like the, he went into the 49ers and made the transition there, uh, we're making a transition here where we want to uh, be on top. So uh, definitely somebody like that to come speak to us is definitely um, rewarding for us and at the same time uh, motivational because we want to uh, be on that level as well. What did you get out of his speech to the team? Um, his speech to the team, um, the comment he actually made if you're a house flower or uh, what did he say, what, field corn. Um, it was kind of funny, but at the same time, it's, uh, it's kind of true. Um, we're not always going to come out here on a, in a perfect, perfect condition. Uh, sometimes it's going to rain our practice. Sometimes you're going to be in a slump. Um, you know, it's basically, he told us, you know, get over the obstacles, get over the little stuff, and uh, just get better every day. Um, you know, right now, I should be worried about, you know, how could I get better, you know, tomorrow than I did today. So um, his message to the team basically was just, you know, everything's not going to be perfect. And to um, get over the obstacles and uh, always get better every day.